Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to the Perfect Genetics Challenge. And isn't this image so freaking creepy? It is actually Joey and, you know, he is haunting us like usual. But I caught him or I paused the game right when he was walking through the walls. And oh my goodness, this looked like some paranormal activity or some sort of horror movie and it just looks absolutely disturbing you know what it's actually kind of creeping me out let's just bring down the walls there he goes he looks a little bit more happy now <laughs> you know our ghost our beloved loved ones i mean they always look so happy but anyways uh let's just go ahead and start this um bendy does have a work in about an hour so we're just gonna get her situated as far as you know getting some breakfast making oh wrong one but let's just make sure um yeah she still needs to eat anyways but everything else is pretty good oh my goodness she actually did not get enough sleep uh let's go ahead and make our beds because uh, you know we need to I was like looking at their icon like why is everyone looking so upset? I mean their their moodlets are kind of okay, but of course we are still mourning um, You know the death of our beloved loved ones And look at Joey here just chillaxing watching some TV, you know, you know, yeah <laughs> All right, so um we need to get this bathroom fixed ASAP. It is freaking ridiculous. It's gonna, it's gonna be like a huge puddle all over our bathroom. Let's see who is available and is not hungry as of this moment. Um, let's have Shauna come and repair the all-in-one. Oh, Shauna! No, no, not Shauna. Misty. Let's have Misty repair this. And oh my goodness, our house is just filthy. It is. Filthy, you guys see this? It's just no. All right, we're gonna go ahead and have her clean up. Then she can go ahead and grab some breakfast. You know what? Let's have her grab breakfast first because she's eventually gonna have to clean up anyway. So that would only make sense, right? And our little Edgar here is still sleeping. Um, well, I was gonna say he could sleep in, but actually, yeah, he could totally he could totally sleep in. Let's go ahead and pull this and let him sleep in a little longer since it is. Oh wait, never mind. It's actually Friday. So he does have school. Alright, we'll have him grab some food. I don't know why I thought it was like Saturday or something where, you know, they don't have school today. Only in La La Land does that happen. Okay, we're just gonna go ahead and get mail because this thing's been sticking up for quite a while. <laughs> oh my goodness. Ooh. Oh, oh, that felt good. <laughs> I don't know where my nose start tickling and tingling and yeah. Hey, go ahead and clean up. Don't you just hate it after you sneeze? You still have this like leftover tingling sensation in your nose like you want to sneeze again, but it's just, it won't come, it won't come. And then your nose starts getting stuffy, which, uh, I don't know. Alright, so, um... Bridget, right? Yes, Bridget here wants to become more muscular because I don't know why that is. Well, that is her lifetime wish. I don't know. This is only 600. Let's actually go ahead and do this one. Buy something worth at least a thousand simoleons. It's totally doable. We're going to cancel this one. No need for you to be so buff, sweetie. So, okay, so we're going to go ahead and buy something. Just go ahead and buy something for 1,000 simoleons. Um, maybe we can we can spend it on like a hobby item. Maybe I don't know. Let's see what is worth a thousand simoleons. Oh, these things are actually not as expensive as I thought they would be. But uh, dang, this, this sculpting thing was worth a thousand. Damn it! Dang it! Dang it! Dang it! Dang it! I was gonna say let's just repurchase this thing. But um, you know what? We do need some decor in this house. So let's actually invest a thousand on a um, sculpture or something, I guess. That would only make sense, right? Since we do, oh, this is worth too much money. Um, Something worth a thousand that's not too big. Ooh, I think we could do this. Since they are pet lovers, we'll go ahead and purchase this thing for our, can we move this down? Yes, we can. Bam! Worth 1500 
to buy some plates with pet images on them. Really, this is worth 1500 just for some simple plates with some pet pictures. I don't know. I don't know. They must be really good pet lovers to be purchasing or investing so much money on just some plates with some pet pictures. Okay, whatever. <laughs> um, all right, I think you are about... Oh, let's have you use the rest... Oh, darn it. The school bus is here. Okay, you know what? Just just use the restroom really quickly and then head off to school. Oh my god, my nose is like... Oh, uh, can I even explain? Oh yeah. And we got love letters. We got love letters. Okay, let's just let's, let's see what we can have everyone do. You need to work on inventing skills, so we'll go ahead and invent. <clears throat> Since you did collect quite a lot of scraps... Hey, why? what is wrong with you guys? Why do you guys not listen to what I want you to do? Like, what is the deal? Um, you know, I was totally trying to decorate this house and run down, you know, our household funds. But, I don't know. I'm kind of lazy. <laughs> okay, we'll, we'll, we'll just have these money aside for whatever reasons that we might need it later. I don't know. Um, you know what, let's, okay, you're going to school, you cannot clean this, uh, let's have you work hard, and, um, you're using the only one bathroom, then let's have you clean it, because it is pretty, pretty filthy, and then we're going to have you eat some leftovers, and you can go ahead and take a shower, what, what broke, oh my goodness, dude, everything is seriously breaking in our household, I have like the worst, worst luck ever when it comes to broken items in our household I don't know why I mean you know appliances I mean not broken items oh my goodness I don't know what the deal is all right um Bridget doesn't really have a job I kind of want her to get a job well up until now she still has not oh yeah I had her retired I was like she still did not quit I was like what but um hey are you done already did you get hurt or something no 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 come and invent some more invent just oh dang it okay so we're gonna go ahead and have him visit the junkyard where is the junkyard and just you know collect the whole bunch of scraps because we keep running out for whatever reason and dig through dig oh why can't we dig through what what there's not there's nothing left to dig for this junk pile. Try again later. I didn't know there's a time limit on this. Like, I guess someone digged through it already. And, um, yeah. You know what? We'll, we'll continue inventing when we come back. Just in case someone starts rummaging through this pile of junk. And then we won't have anything else. We're not really going to salvage this. I don't feel like salvaging it. Nah. Is there anything else? There's only like three pile of junk, really. I thought there would be way more than that. And I... I thought you can rummage through this, but this is only for decor, so it's fine. Alright, so, um, I don't know if you guys watched my 100 baby video, but I really, really want to give the daycare career a try. Just because I've never, I never done it before, and I don't know, I don't exactly know how that works, so I am really, really tempted to try. So, let, you know what, let, let's have Bridget become, uh, um the daycare profession i really want to see what that whole career is about like what do you really do like do you, do they really bring kids or like toddlers into our house and we take care of them i've never tried it so let's give it a try you know since you know these sims really have nothing better to do um we're gonna have brian go ahead and clean up oh oh lifeguard cpr dummy Magician. Oh, daycare. Okay, so let's go ahead and read this even though some of you might already know what this is But I don't so I'm gonna read it. Okay, so as an amateur babysitter Do you have what it takes to keep toddlers and children happy if feeding 
playing and changing dirty diapers sounds attractive to you, this profession might be your calling. Eventually, you will also be able to care for children as well as toddlers and make sure they are on the right track to success in school and properly behave. Start caring and teaching kids of this town now. So we're going to go ahead and accept her hours are Monday through Thursday, 9 to 7, and uh, we get 100 simoleons a week. So we're going to go ahead and accept. All right, crying children and erratic moods are not for everyone. Amateur babysitters may think a little tender. Love will do the trick, but they'll have to be quick on their toes to care for two kids at once. Grab your baby bottles and toys because this might be a bumpy ride. Congratulations, you have unlocked the new uniform. And yeah. All right, so that sounds very, very interesting. I really wonder what it is about and how do we go about, you know, doing this profession. And I think it's so fitting that, you know, all our Sims dislikes children. Like, she dislikes children, she does, and he does, and she does, and he does. So it's really fitting that, you know, they become babysitters and, you know, they hate children. I mean, what could be better than that? All right, our Sims looks absolutely, ooh, improved, great. Okay, yeah, they look absolutely sad. Very, very sad. And she's taking out the trash. <clears throat> so she doesn't start until, I guess, tomorrow morning. Oh, she doesn't start until two days. Okay, never mind. We don't even get to try it out maybe until the next part. So responsibilities are general daycare, take care of toddlers and children, friendship with kids, befriend the kids, and handle emergencies. Deal with daycare emergencies for clients as they come. Interesting. All right, I am so excited to try out this profession. Like, I am seriously hyped up to do it. Like, I'm ready. And we can't even start until, in like, another three more days. What is up with that? All right, so um, I did get a comment saying that with this toy maker, we can make something for the toddlers. I really want to see what we can make. Let's go ahead and make a doll. I mean, do we have a dollhouse already? I think we, we do. I think I tried that already, right? Oh, no, we didn't. So let's go ahead and build a dollhouse. And, um, ooh, this is the one that uh, one of you guys mentioned to make a baby play mat. So let's go ahead and make let's go ahead and make that one first. I want to see what it looks like. And um, there was something else that we can make. A balloon animal, I think. Let's go ahead. Actually, no, we already made a balloon animal. We're gonna go ahead and make the doll house. That just looked really interesting. All right, do you have a job? No, you don't. You know, let's go and have you finish. Oh, we can go just go and scrap it. Let's scrap it. Uh, she's about to get off work in about one more hour. You, uh, you're still digging through. All right, that's fine. We're gonna have you come home once you're done. And this is still not clean. I thought I had someone clean this. Like what? What the hee haw? What the freaking hee haw? Oh, is it? Oh, never mind. It is clean. Huh? Never mind. I'm tripping. I uh, mowed it. I uh, mowed it. And this bed is still not made. So we're gonna have her make this bed. Hmm. Ooh, ice cream truck. Well, let's see, how is Michi doing? Michi wants to watch TV. Oh, come here and watch TV. Stop, stop, stop mourning. You know, I feel like adding some special effects to my video nails, because it looked like it would make it more interesting, right? I don't know. Like... I wouldn't know how to go about editing and you know adding in special effects, but I want to I want to really give it a try. So maybe I'll try it in this part or the next. I don't know. I haven't really figured it out yet. But that's something I do want to try doing. Um. Hey, I don't know how you watch TV. What? What? Why are you not? Oh, someone turn off the TV. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and turn this on, so you could watch TV. So speaking of dogs, I watched this most hilarious video on uh, Facebook. You know, like people post up random videos and stuff. And then there was this uh, one video where it says, um, what happened? How to stop, you know, your if you have a dog and a cat as a pet living together, how to get 
the cats to stop hitting the dog is that the dog would literally sit on their head. It is the most hilarious video I've seen in a while. Like, you see these cats attacking the dogs, right? And the dogs just sit on their face. It is so funny. If you guys want, go ahead and try YouTubing it. I don't know, like, dog sits on cat head or something like that, but... It is hilarious how these dogs just just sits on their head like it's like a a whole different bunch of like animals and uh, pets and a whole like a bunch of different clips together. But oh look at Bridget and um Brian they're just you know macking it right in the hallway <laughs> for everyone to see. Oh boy this girl is so stressed and everything on top. So we're gonna go ahead and have her just play a little computer game, just play a little racing game, and then come and just uh, sleep, sleep for a little bit. And oh my goodness, this boy is stressed as well, but he does want to do his homework. So once he comes home, we're gonna have him um, play a little game or watch a little TV. Actually, we'll have him watch TV. I don't know why every time when I have them queue up to do something and they're on a school bus, it automatically cancels out and they have to ride their bike or they take a taxi home. Doesn't make any sense. All right, so, um, so she's playing a little game just to build up her fun moodlet. Um, I don't know. Does does Bridget need to build up her skills or anything as far as you know being a babysitter or amateur babysitter? I would assume cooking would be one of them, but I don't know. I don't exactly know. Let's go and have her clean this up. It is filthy, <clears throat> or it will be filthy in a minute. And it's kind of fitting. We already have a nursery. Oh, we should probably buy a high chair, huh? I think that would be pretty useful. But we will put it in the nursery room. Let's see if we have any room to actually put it in here. Like I don't want to. I don't want it to be too like crammed in together with everything else. Um, I mean, if if her daycare profession does like take off, then we'll go ahead and expand this room. I mean, we have plenty of space to expand. We can stretch it out, um, add a little more things to it. So we, that's definitely considerable. <laughs> this girl wants to have a baby. No, your baby making are done. All right, so Bridget is going to go ahead and sleep. Oh, God, this girl. This girl is so tired. All right, so you're, you're going to watch TV. I don't know what to have everyone else do. Like, I seriously don't know. You know what? Let's go ahead and have him. Um, oh, my phone is like going off. It's going off. Okay, let's go ahead and have him stop. And you know what? Let's just collect these. These things are kind of bugging me a little bit just because it's just sitting there and it's like kind of a, I don't know, very distracting. Like, I'm very observant. <laughs> like, I was observe my surroundings. Okay, maybe not so much based on how I've been playing lately, but. I don't know, I've just been noticing those little collection rocks just sitting there and it's, it's kind of bugging me. Alright, let's see, what is uh, everyone else up to? Alright, you have enough fun. Let's have you um, go ahead and do your homework. Oh, actually, we, we're not really in a rush to do it since tomorrow is Saturday. They don't have school, but one of his little wish. I don't know what you really call this. Their wish? I don't know. Get attention from dad. Oh, we'll do that. But, yeah, he wants to do homework. And uh, we're going to go ahead and do that. And, oh, that's what I wanted him to do. Go ahead and finish inventing. I'm just going to have him invent. I wonder if he scrapped his um, previous invention. And, oh, let's see. What does she make as far as um, that little play mat? Um, oh, this is, this is really, really cute, I think. Let me see. I can't really see it. Oh my god, this thing is freaking adorable. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and put this here. And, um, can we put it over here? I've never seen this before. Seriously, I have never, ever seen this thing before. And it looks absolutely adorable. Holy cow, this thing is really, really cute. Alright, I'm glad I made this. And thank you for, I forgot who told me, but thank you for letting me know to make this because it is really really adorable and this is this we're just gonna sell this. this is a little misfit hey didn't i have her make a dollhouse too let's have her make a dollhouse i wonder if you can get hurt from doing this i don't know i think you can 
and you know what guys i totally forgot to upload my speed build for this like i think i mentioned it like two parts ago i was going to upload it maybe before or after that part but i totally forgot so i think it should be up already if not then i'll go ahead and upload it very soon like i'm a little behind on my little speed build that i've been doing and uh, yeah so it's a little surprise for you guys i do have some speed build like i want to add a little more things than just let's play and challenges onto my channel i want to do some speed builds and then um as you guys might have already known i did my first collab with spring sims and it was a really really exciting experience so go check it out if you haven't already or i'll go ahead and link it down below for you guys to go check it out and um yeah i don't i don't know i i felt like what i built wasn't as nice but she really really decorated and it just looks fabulous absolutely fabulous so yeah, go ahead and check out that video as well as checking out Spring Sims. And yeah, that was a really fun collab. <clears throat> it makes you really like, you know, um, kind of make more friends when you do these collabs because you, you guys interact more, you know, off um, just in the comments. You get to really message each other and just kind of, you know, collab and work on the, um, the video as well as, you know, when you're going to upload it. So it was a lot of fun. I really had a lot of fun. All right, we're gonna go ahead and wake this girl up, and we're gonna go ahead and have her eat some leftovers. And what are you two doing? Be saluted. Oh, I guess cuz. Wait, no, she's not in the military. Why would you salute? Doesn't really make any sense, but okay. But you guys are not really getting along, so we're gonna go ahead and split you guys up. Um, did you finish your homework already? Yes. Oh. You're such a good boy. So go ahead and grab yourself some food. And uh, looks like we're going to be putting everyone to bed pretty early. Just because they're really, really tired already. And no, I'm not yawning. I'm just like trying to burp without making a very obvious sound. <laughs> I know, I'm, I'm so disgusting. Or so unladylike. Not really disgusting, but unladylike. I'm really not ladylike whatsoever. You guys don't even know. I'm, uh, yeah. Hey, there's no more food. You guys ate all his food. All right, let's go ahead and have a quick meal. Let's just, just grab some cereal. And then uh, we're going to have uh, Misty go ahead and serve up some. You know what? She's not the chef in the house. Uh, Bridget is, right? Yeah, Bridget's not doing anything. So we're going to go ahead and have Bridget serve up some dinner. Uh, serve up some sushi as well, as well as some mac and cheese. And you know what? I should really, really get a replicator. I think Misty, yeah, she has more than enough um, lifetime reward points to get a replicator. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Ooh, fireproof home. We're going to get that while she's still alive. Because I feel like, I really feel like... Um, We've been having the worst luck lately. But where is the food replicator? Okay, it's a lot more expensive than that. You know what? Let's do this. Let's just arrange this alphabetically. Um, Is it? Oh, here it is. I was looking for that little icon, but I didn't see it. All right, so we're going to go ahead and place this in our house. Because I totally forgot to move it. What does when I went ahead and built it? And oh! Oh, here is the dollhouse. Oh, it looks really, really crappy than the one you get to buy just off um, uh, buy mode. But we're going to go ahead and place this here. Oh, it doesn't look too bad, I don't think, right? I know it's kind of dark. Let me, let me um, turn on the lights in here so you can really see what it looks like. It does look really, really crappy though. Like, come on. It's just two beds, a kitchen, a living room. There's no dining room, you know. It's cool. These sims don't need to sit down and eat. Or, you know, the little dollhouse only to sit down and eat. <clears throat> wow, we really wasted a lot of our lifetime points. Uh, does Bridget have a lot? Yeah, she does too. Okay, so we still have a lot of spare lifetime points to buy anything that we want to buy, which is great. <coughs> <clears> hmm, <throat> oh, let's see, let's see, let's see, what are you doing? No, no, huh, 
come over here. Everyone get away from Bridget. Oh, actually, no. She already cooked it. Well, let's go and have them um, so store anchovy. Ugh, anchovy. I don't think that would be a pretty good meal, but okay. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and put this kid to bed because he is exhausted. We're going to go ahead and sleep. Oh, you can't make bed? Snorkel? Oh. What? You can snorkel in bed? I didn't know that. Interesting. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to go ahead and turn this light off so we don't waste our electricity. <clears throat> um, okay, after you store it, go ahead and... Oh, it's like, is this broken? What? Let's go ahead and um grab a plate. Let's see, anyone else hungry? Everyone's fine. Okay, uh, Misty is getting a little hungry, so we're going to have her grab some food. And um, Bridget is cooking. When she's done, we can actually have her just head to bed. It is, it is actually pretty late. <clears throat> I mean, not as late at all, but it's a good time to go to bed. Let's just put it that way. <laughs> Alright, so she's gonna grab food and then uh, Misty's gonna go ahead and come to bed afterwards. So is Brian. Brian, go ahead and go to sleep. And then we're gonna have Isaac, right? Isaac? Yes! I got the name right. We're gonna have Isaac actually go ahead and use the all in one bathroom and then go ahead and head off to bed. And, you know, Bridget's just kind of finishing up with the cooking. Oh, I cannot wait until we get to the daycare um, uh, day where we actually start our job. And I just want to see what, what can we really do with this profession. Like, I really haven't tried it out. So, it is the first time for me it's going to be fun. It's going to be a lot of fun for me, guys. <laughs> Alright, so, um, since everyone is pretty much heading off to bed, I am going to go and... um. End this part here. Well, I actually had a lot of fun playing this part for some reason. Usually with with the with this challenge, I'm just kinda like eh. Like you're not really looking forward to it, but I actually had fun in this part. Surprisingly, you know? Alright, so um hope you guys did enjoy this part as much as I had fun playing it. And uh, hopefully we will get to start our um, Bridget's job by the next part because it is still um, only Saturday. Hopefully I can get through Saturday and Sunday very very quickly and uh, yeah like always thank you for watching I hope you guys have a wonderful day and of course don't forget to comment rate and subscribe if you haven't already that is <laughs> and I will see you guys in my next video bye everyone <laughs>